Well, hello there. I'm slightly overexposed at the moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fit this sunglass to my lens. It's an ND filter. Now, if I can get it on right. This is one of the downsides to the uh, DJI Osmo Action 4 is that you have these screw-on lenses. And they're really difficult to get on. Yeah, I've got it on now. There we go. Just one second while I tighten it up. Ah, there we go. Right, now nice and tight. Yes, now I like to shoot in 24 frames a second. And I use the 1 over 80 rule, which means that I'm shooting uh, with an exposure of 1 over 48th of a second. Now, to get enough light into the camera, uh, or sorry, to reduce the amount of light that goes into the camera, you have to fit one of these ND filters. Now, what I've got here if, is a whole kit I've got from number 8 ND all the way up to 64. Now, at the moment, the light is, is good enough to use this, uh, this number 8 filter. But obviously, during the bright sunlight, I will stick on a 64. Now, it will help you catch this natural motion blur that you can see rather than having the you know the, the the very sharp vivid images that you get with uh without the nd filter it's it's one of those things that uh i i like to do uh but you can actually run the camera without having the nd filter on it just makes a little bit of difference as you'll see uh when i when i do some more action shots later on anyway that's enough of that I'll catch you all on the next one.